Ah, fuck the music. Okay. We're live. I'm gonna play the music again. <laughs> yeah, I told you not baby. to play the music as in trouble you cut. Let's get the mic over here. Alrighty. Alright, welcome. Good idea. Two changes, one well, mic, a little bit further back camera. New stuff, new things happening. We're just things. making things better and better every <laughs> fucking time. It's oh, fucking. Baby. How 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 are we doing? How are we doing it so well? Like, but just everybody <laughs> loves it. We're born for this, baby. No, this is what we're supposed to be doing. <laughs> it's is, fucking great. This is what we're made to do, man. We're made to, you know what? Lock us down. Lock us down, fucking Justin Drew. I was up hiding in the cottage, the cunt, and uh, everything's yeah. It's all gonna go back, to, not to normal. It's not gonna go back to normal, but it's gonna get better though. The first sip of coffee in the day just yeah. makes me want to come. Just makes me want to fucking find Trudeau. Oh, yeah, <laughs> that, that too. And he's caught it. No, I would. Yeah, I don't care. He's he's gone now anyway. He, I I think he's retired. I basically retired today. He says he's a close contact. It's not even a thing anymore. Um, anybody that's on this, yeah, write in your fucking comments, whatever, and um, we will we'll get to read them. If you want to go over, are we on your Facebook? Is it? Uh, yeah, not, yeah we're, right. we're on Matt's That's Facebook, right. Matt Rinder's Facebook as well. If you want to go, if you want to write comments there, it might be a better stream. This is fine too. Some people don't like turning their phones on the side or whatever. But um, yeah, do whatever you want. Such uh, a such an issue with people turning your phone onto one fucking side. I still can't yeah. get over that. Oh, fix it. Fi you fucking fix it. You fucking Some people, retards. Yeah. Some people Holy just shit, can't do dude. it. But uh, we, uh, we fucking, who gives a bollocks? Welcome, I think this is episode 13, is it? I think so. Yeah, and, uh, it's yeah. episode 13. Having fun, Dungeon are... Comedy is killing it. Again, there's fucking, we got more more shows. So right. today is Thursday, if you're watching it. Uh, tomorrow, Friday the 20, I don't know what date it is, but like, whatever day tomorrow. The Friday in this week is, um, we got a killer lineup, so get on to me for tickets and all that shit. That's right, that's yeah. right. Friday night. We got a secret one tonight. Darren's headline for his first time. I am. Yeah. I am. Headline for the first time. That's right. And um, he's going to take lots of mushrooms. He's going to probably go over his time somehow. He's going to. Yesterday to I had a ten minute splat, splat and uh, we fucking. I went for eighteen minutes, and I literally got no laughs whatsoever for ten minutes in the middle, and I didn't <laughs> give a bollocks because, yeah, it's my time up there. We're having fun, it's fucking whatever. But yeah, I'm headlining tonight. It, it, there's a seat if you do if you are watching this live and want to go to that show you get onto Matt, Matt here for tickets and that's right. um, yeah and fucking yeah that's it shows for the next few weeks and uh, yeah if you want to donate to the Patreon all that shit uh, we, we get need better, money better guys. equipment we, we do we need, need money. we need money because we're trying to fix everything yeah. we're trying to fix everything in the apartment we're trying to like get it cleaned up we're getting fucking Joe you know, getting new equipment getting new everything we also we um, yeah i don't know yeah i i don't know man we we need we need we need help we yeah, need, we need help with feel this. like a low energy now i yeah. just like i woke up this morning and i saw that like justin trudeau's gone into hiding away from the truckers and uh i just used all my energy like getting excited this morning and uh that was uh, yeah so i don't really have too much energy left me neither man yeah but uh, yeah. we'll, we'll get through this, though. We'll get through this. I think, mm -hmm. I think we'll, we'll, we're going to have a good time. We were looking through our, our demographics. That's right. And uh, we were looking through the demographics on Spotify, and it said that fucking 4% of, uh, of our listeners were women. So we were like, that's pretty good. That's four, like, I mean, from the shit we we're talking about, like, that's... Yeah. Four, like four no, percent that, that, you know, that's just pretty decent like yeah. I, I yeah perfect that's unless perfect. you're mathematically inclined because uh, four percent of uh four percent we do we do we <laughs> dove a little deeper we dove a little deeper <laughs> see who these women were and uh, that four percent is actually just was just one one woman one and we wanted to see how she was doing and uh yeah. we wanted to make sure she wasn't unemployed so we just uh we got her in to to clean the apartment guys we're and they, they're we're, cheaper than men like women <clears throat> women are cheaper than men you usually. can pay them cheaper and like everyone complains about it and all yeah. that but you you can still do it so it's not costing us anything basically she's still getting paid more than yeah. me though we guys. like we get five dollars a month on the patreon so that's how much she gets she gets five dollars uh, yeah. a month to pay for the thing so uh yeah we um and that's why so we want all, all our listeners we'd like to help them we might ask her a few questions will we ask her a few questions 
Yeah, well, when she's here, I mean, yeah. like she's gonna she's get. She's not. You're not getting out of the work. Yeah, you, you fi- finish, finish what you're doing. Finish. finish what you're doing, and then we might like we'll, we might bring her in, ask her a couple of questions. Why, if, wait, if why is it getting more messy? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I swept this. Oh. Look, I'm helping. Oh. No, he said, why is it not picked up off the floor? <laughs> So we will we'll have her in. We'll ask her a few questions if that's okay with you guys. I know you want to hear man shit all the time, and like we're two fucking you know manly men, but we we got to try to see our feminine side this time. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. As soon as she's done, she's gonna pop in, and uh, we're gonna ask her a few questions. If you hate her, just tell us. Tell us like get her off the screen because like she does talk a lot. She talks a lot. Like wears the ear off us sometimes after shows and stuff so if it's getting too much for you guys just let us know and we'll we'll put her back in the corner we'll, we have her chain is over there whatever so um, i'd like to welcome to the show welcome to two gingers one mike miss hannah Veldoon, everybody thanks guys welcome hannah welcome yeah that's a good oh uh, no i'll leave the <laughs> <laughs> yeah. no actually no i thought because i'm i'm trying to help you guys get views right so right like here we go. Nice. There. That's good. That's good. <laughs> perfect. Perfect. So, um, just make sure everyone's happy with this so far. Yeah. Yeah. No complaint. Because <laughs> okay. uh, we do have a lot of viewers. Frankie, that, that Frankie hate here is, is really loving. Complaint. Frankie's loving. Does your, she speak yeah, English? Yeah, loving your performance. <laughs> How do you need money? English. You have I a fucking name. Don't let me speak yeah. at all. But yeah, I do speak English. We need more money. We can't be giving her five dollars a month. Like she's not going to be able. To, she can't. Like that doesn't even. <laughs> Like we provide the clothes and everything, but yeah. I mean, she's she needs more money than that. She needs to eat. Like not not too much, obviously. We need to fucking. <laughs> <laughs> I love Frankie. Okay, she can stay. Okay, good. All right. All right. Thanks, uh, Frankie. Do Do you know anything about women? <laughs> <laughs> what do they like to talk about? Will we ask her? <laughs> what do women like to talk about? Oh no, I said I wouldn't put you on the spot. Uh, yeah. What should we ask? What should we ask? We've got uh, we've got a wealth of lot knowledge I, I, here. There's I'm, a lot of shit I want to know about women. Like I am happy like, why to are you represent up? Why are the you fucking so crazy? female demographic. Well, you are the yeah. entire female <laughs> demographic here. This Jared is goes, it. We found out we had yeah. 4% female viewers. I go, that's just me. Yeah. <laughs> like, I am the 4%. Um, but I also heard you were excited that so I'm... So does that mean... That probably means actually we have zero female viewers today. Oh yeah, it'll be zero yeah. after this episode. Well, I think sure. we're gonna promote it. We're just gonna like hide our faces in it, pretend it's yeah. just just you talking, yeah. and uh, we bring in a few more women. Yeah. Yeah. Because eventually, lot- this this might help somehow. Maybe yeah. like that's actually kind of what we have in mind. We Matt, could, Matt texted me yesterday. Yeah. He said. Uh, also, uh, <laughs> Hannah's actually bisexual as well. Like we're we're gaining a lot of points for this. <laughs> oh yeah, we're gonna be on CNN. They're gonna be praising our names. Yeah. Diverse gingers create fucking diverse yeah. podcasts. Yeah, well we're 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 promoting equality here. We are 100. Yeah. percent This yeah. is a workplace. This is a workplace. You are a woman. Yeah. Yeah. And we are men. But yeah. equality, like we we're not paying like full minimum wage or anything. I mean You're yeah, not but, but we're, to, we're getting yeah. there yeah. we can't start yeah. at the end like we're, we're beginning we're beginning you have our to journey give me something to work towards like yeah. or else I'm just not going to do a good job Frankie so, yeah. says break her legs so she's disabled <laughs> too. Just, that, that would be yeah. pretty easy yeah I could I could do it would you yeah. be up for that because yeah. you get like then and we wouldn't have to pay you because you'd be on disability. So we, we would get it for free. We'd get that $5 back. And you would have back. a disabled person on the podcast. So another point. Yeah. Uh, would, you would you be yeah. willing to do blackface? Would you be willing to do blackface? Yeah. yeah okay. We could. So we don't need to get any more guests then. We're, no. we're good. I'll just. We're good. I'll be yeah. here. Yeah. <laughs> my broken legs. And you're, you're, you could kind of pass for ginger. Like my, not... my dad is ginger. Is he? So uh, my hair you're is one dyed. Of us. You're but one of I us. am, yeah. It, if I leave my natural hair, it goes a bit ginger yeah. in the sun, yeah. 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 He's just, he just looks like a combination of you guys. Oh, yeah, <laughs> when cool. I see you, I'm like, oh, yeah, that's just L- lucky my guy. dad. We, we've <laughs> got <laughs> Hannah's dad energy. That, yeah, what is, you do. What does that mean? We're well, also going to abuse you? So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he did not abuse me. Okay. Uh, <laughs> that's, <laughs> just, well, that's not anything. <laughs> we make shit up here at yeah. the podcast. Uh, two gingers, one I'm white. fucked up, but for other reasons. Um, so yeah, I was, I was actually gonna, that was actually the first question that I had is how was your relationship with your father? <laughs> because, because you said yes to coming on to this, we just, just assumed, assumed I was, was just, <laughs> yeah. 
We have a female? What's wrong with her? That was the first question. He didn't have a father. He wasn't in the picture. Yeah. Um, So it was good. So it was good. Good. Okay. (laughs) Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. So why... So just give us... Why in general are women so crazy? Because we, we've been asking oh. ourselves this. Well, what makes women crazy? Because I know, yeah, no, I'm not crazy. No, you have your personal brand of crazy and it might be very lovable. And I've loved different women's version of crazy. But you're all crazy. And that's why we love you. Tell us yeah. why you're crazy. What the fuck? Why I personally or women in women general? Women in general. I want you to speak on behalf of people. Oh, I want people to be angry about this. I yeah, want people okay. to be angry about this. Um, well, we're definitely like trying to um like attach ourselves to you guys like all the time whether we Mm. will admit it or not so and then we do crazy stuff to do that Mm. like we just do you have an example have you done that what do you what yeah with every boyfriend yeah okay yeah (laughs) like of course um but because we can't survive on our own well if you start you like one day you're like leaving your sweater at his place and then the next day you're like you're you're storing his semen inside no no my the way i do it is i always like i pretend (laughs) (laughs) yeah i'll just like flip the condom inside out and like you know yeah the, yeah exactly. have you done that have you no ever, uh, yeah. <laughs> Jesus. i don't know you seem pretty i'm not trying to get mm. pregnant um but it is ladies that's a great way to lock down a man is um yeah just get pregnant um but no well, drake I, has taught people yeah, a lesson now sauce, with the hot sauce yeah. in, so you gotta be careful but I, also if you're if you see red cum don't fuck yourself with that like that's even if it's not hot sauce but that's what if, ace but if they think like <laughs> no but he did fuck me really hard maybe his dick was bleeding yeah again <laughs> i don't know why you would want to put that inside of you uh, well, you just really want drake's kids uh, yeah yeah i don't think we have that uh do you, do you think anybody oh yeah is your cum just like a little bit red because you're gingers <laughs> it's like no. a i've been asked that before <laughs> Which is like weird. A tinge of red. Yeah, just oh, or like, or fucking, you've read pubic hair, so do you've read uh, yeah. red jizz? Like, yeah, yeah that's... I, I don't really have that problem. Like, if anyone comes into my bedroom, yeah. nobody's trying to get pregnant. By me. <laughs> yeah. they, they know they're like I have no money. Up like, the if, if I, like, they're like, no, keep it. I'm paying for this baby all on my own. Look, this guy can't yeah. even support himself, and I'll have to pay him. I'll have to yeah. feed him. They, they'll yeah. be like, no, I don't need two babies. No. If I had red cum, cleaning this fit. place would have been a lot harder. Like you're just these white walls. Oh, I don't even know what I'm cleaning. God. Oh, uh, oh man. Right. I'll just keep joining. I'll I wouldn't. I wouldn't even need to paint. Yeah. Yeah. Just slowly. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So slowly. So that's like a day's. That's a day's work. So women are. So the short answer is the reason women are so crazy is because of men. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No. 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 I, I said it was sense. because we can't. Like we, uh, like evolution wise, we can't really like survive on our own. And it's like in our head to like latch onto a man and get pregnant. But like the world has kind of changed, but like we haven't. So we are okay. still like Thank in that mindset. Thank you. So, if, so yeah. we did have women listeners, they'd be screaming yeah. at me. Be oh, like, yeah, I can hate- survive on my own. This yeah. was my no, question. <laughs> this was my question for you. You can try, but you can't. Other than your dad, this was the number one question. Are men and women equal? Well, I mean, you know, separate but equal. What do you What do you want me to but, <laughs> like? But de- no, of but course definitely not. not equal in no. any way. But like, men can't yeah. do. That's things a woman speak. Like, like, no, <laughs> I was put a, my opinion out first, so that her opinion has changed. Yeah, whatever. No, I don't know. Not. I want. No, we're not. No, but we're different in different ways. Okay. Like, like if I, I, anyone tries to tell me that a man has more attention to detail than a woman is fucking insane. Like, of course, women are better at that evolution wise. But if anyone. Sorry, is like, I wasn't listening. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but then if you're like, are men funnier? Yeah, well, of course. Boy, well, that, that, uh, no, you know, shit. Like, on a whole. So in, why would you go into comedy? Because I think I'm funnier than a lot of men. But I think on a whole, men are funnier That's than badass. women. Um, it's badass. Well, ju- it is but that, But that is just because more men do it, though. Do you know, more men do comedy. We both have, yeah, yeah, yeah. We both have the capacity. I, I, no, but this is what I'm yeah. saying. Like, That's like me going point. into basketball, though. 
It's like, yeah, like I'm shorter than everybody else there. I'm probably yeah, gonna but, suck. But, but be, like, but being funny is just about your experience. Exactly. Like, it's just about your past exactly. experience. Like no one can say like nobody's funnier than Miss Pat. You know, like nobody's funnier. Uh, absolutely. They, they, do you know? She's fucking funny. Like she's just hilarious, and but, it's like other people can they write jokes better or whatever? Maybe, maybe not. Well, but nobody I'm has Miss yeah. Pat's life. It yeah, but I, on, okay, I have a theory on, on that. Life. I have a theory on that. Uh, woman in comedy, okay, but they gotta be black. <laughs> <laughs> black Fuck women you. are so much funnier so than white men. Uh, yeah, we'll say with black men are funnier than white men, so whatever. Joe, Joe Brand, comedian <laughs> in that. Uh, Dude, we're getting so diverse here, it's great. We're yeah, that's super what we, I, we, I want to change, yeah. I was like punching the walls. Mean, with the, with the, uh, let me clear, with the women, men being funnier than women, I'm agreeing with you that like, Evolution has set you guys up to be funnier. Where like you go out, you take risks. You're like making jokes to your buddies, and then you're all fucking gassing each other up. And then you go. Whereas women, it's just like not that culture is not there. So I do we have the ability to be as funny? Yeah. Sure, but like on a whole, it's just like not the same culture. Do you still see that? Because like now, when I look, like we talk about this a lot. When I look at men now, I'm like, if I like. Th- m- the way I think about it, if I was a kid growing up now, I wouldn't be able to call a man dad anymore. Like, I wouldn't be able to call, a, like, a millennial could not be a father to me. Like, I, you're you're just a bitch. <laughs> you're, you're, you're a bitch, okay? Not you, the, the this, guy. I'm looking at you. Was this whole but, thing just to call me a bitch? No, but, <laughs> like, no. All right, Hannah, thanks for your time. So, no. <laughs> Shut up. So, okay, uh, so no. Say so, goodbye to Hannah, everybody. So the question is: the question is, do you still see that? Because you're you're saying, okay, men take risks. Men are men are like yeah. the leaders, uh, d- leading the charge. When you look at men in our fucking demographic, oh, our generation, are you? Yeah, do you less, still see less, that, for sure. or do you look at these guys and you're like, like, do you see what I see? Because I look around and I'm like, dude, like. You're you're this you're the bitch now like they you know yeah. uh, fucking uh they're not real yeah. men they're not real yeah. men but they, there are real men still though. Yeah. like there, there's there's 20 yes, there's 20 yeah. year olds that are that have been brought up correctly like do you know that have I Sure been, but I'm ta- yeah. I'm t- like looking at it from your like yeah. do you see, do you look at that that like do you see that or you like you go to like a fucking you go scouting out the boys or something and you're like, what am I, like, I'm dealing with a fucking, what kind of hand, what kind of cards do I have here? Like, this yeah. is fucking weak. Yeah, of course. But that's, I also have, like, I mean, some women like weak men, I think. Whereas I'm... They can, I, they, they can, that, yeah. yeah. But he I'm can not still make of, money yeah. and all that, but I can manipulate him. Yeah, that that whereas whereas I'm, I'm what you were I'm saying, like, actually. Exactly. So, like, do you think that women look at that from, like, an opportunistic level they're like oh men now are so easy this is great yeah. or are they like oh men now are so easy i want me like a fucking you know a hard to catch like fucking trophy line well, men in general husband. aren't yeah. but like because there's it's such a huge fucking group of people but men in general aren't like there's more of them now i guess but like still still there's men that fucking you know, that, that there's normal people still out there. Like, you know? Dude, I walked... Like, we were talking about this the other day. Like, it was fucking... This was, like, a couple months ago, but it's, like, mid-October. It's, like... It's, like... It's just gone down, like, 15 degrees, and I saw a dude wearing a fucking scarf. <laughs> yeah, but, I mean, it doesn't matter. Take, the, it doesn't take matter that off! Like, like, what are you doing? Take but, like, that fa- off! Fashion is whatever. Like, who, gives, who gives a bollocks yeah. about fashion? Some people wear, you know, different weird yeah. shit. Like, you know, everyone's fashion is different. Who gives I, a fuck about I, weird? I actually, like, Harry Styles, I think, is a perfect example. Like, I know you might be like, oh, you know, he's a pretty boy, but he, he has this, like... I don't give a fuck attitude and that is like for a woman we're like oh my god we love that and he dresses like because it just does what he wants does yeah. what he wants yeah. that, that's like the main thing is yeah. he does what he wants but if you but we, some women probably do look at like a weak yeah. man like a weak well, man there's all articles like, that came out I when he, he wore a dress and all the Christian women were like I but he's never... not weak he's a fucking he's no. a superstar do you exactly. know what I mean like, and, he's but obviously... he also has this like he doesn't like no matter what his next step is if like all these women write articles oh, I wore a dress he's like I don't fucking care and he's, that's hot he's probably like, testing that's... himself he's probably yeah. like what can I do that exactly, they, do you know, yeah. he's probably, I don't know, man, he's Kurt Cobain was doing that like 30 years ago. Well, this yeah, is like, his inspiration exactly, though, and Kurt Cobain's did, fucking cool. Yeah, so. exactly, they were, yeah. <laughs> you're like, it's been done, yeah. it's been done, yeah. Harry Styles, get yeah, fucking back like, to work. <laughs> it's like, but yeah, he, so that, 
let everybody yeah, do whatever they want. actually killed himself, right? Well, so know. that's like that's Harry real. Might. That's real man shit. Harry's you can't not, Harry's Harry, not give, give him time. Yet, right? You gotta, you gotta, you gotta be a real man. He's over twenty-seven. Oh, is that the age? Oh, right. Twenty-seven is when Kirk Cobain killed himself. Oh, yeah. It was the twenty-seven club, like Jimmy Hendrix. He's twenty-seven already. You think? I'd say so. Yeah. Because I'm. Yeah, they were around the same age as me. Like I'm thirty-one. Yeah. But yeah, so I was saying. Women definitely, I'm sure, look at weak men and uh, be like, look, I'd like to, I'll get with him for the security, but I know I'll be able to do anything. But they end up like cheating on them and stuff anyway yeah. after, because they need that other, they yeah. need that other thing yeah. as well. Yeah. Yeah. So if they Are can you have both. Have you ever cheated? Yeah. <laughs> um, have you? Cheated? No. 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 I'm, I'm the one that like. Gets cheated on. Yeah. Like I'm the, because I look for that. Like I look you for. You look the, for a guy who will. Other well, that's like really common. Like yeah. we look for abusers. We're like, oh, what's okay. the guy who's gonna fuck me up the most? Who's gonna just like lie to me and break my heart? And I'm like, oh yeah, like hearts in my eyes. Like that's Some, what I want. Somebody, wow. I fucking, I, I prefer. Not to, that I, prefer to I should introduce yeah. you. I've got a buddy. In <laughs> I, I prefer the credit who said it. I'm just trying to think who said it because there's a great bit, and I'm not even sure if it's a Toronto comedian or someone. If I said it on, uh, or if I saw it online, but uh, they said if you're. Um, if you're if you're a guy that can get tens, uh, if you're a guy that can get that can get with g- girls that are tens, then yeah. uh, good w- good looking women they're always complaining that they, all guys are always cheating on me. But if yeah. you're a guy that ha- like getting a ten, getting with a ten girl is a very hard skill to do. And if you're a guy that has mastered that skill, you're not just doing it once. Yeah. And it's just a fucking great bit. It's like yeah, if you can if you if you're good at getting with girls, if you if you give out that aura that uh, girls like, Love you kind of a lot yeah. of people can get fucking addicted to that, and they're like, mm-hmm. "I gotta do that with the next girl," because it's all about the chase for some, yeah. you know, some. Obviously, that's not the right way to go about it, because it's better to, yeah. you know, whatever is better for different people. Some people like to dress up as animals and whatever, and that's fine. Do you know, that's mm-hmm. grand too. But uh, so, if you saw a guy like walking down the street in a dress, you'd be like, "Yes, like." Come. No, no. Um, it's it, for me. It's like the attitude. It's not that I'm like, "Ooh, Harry style." But if you like, know, what, if you style. know a guy already, and but you yeah. know he's a fucking, but he's, he's like, taken over yeah. the world, and now he's wearing a dress. You're yeah, like, "Fuck I'm yeah!" Like, you've earned, shit. You, you've earned yeah. the right to do whatever the fuck you want. Harry Styles. You know, everyone in the world knows yeah. him. Basically, so it's like whatever, do whatever you yeah. want. Yeah, that's like that's for women. We're like. Yeah, he's so he's so confident. Oh, yeah. He's so exactly. confident. Yeah. So you know, I think I think you're also corrupted by this uh, this this uh, pussification of of, <laughs> of of our youth today, where you're like, ooh, ooh, man in dress, woo, no, swooning. Not at all. Just not at let, all. let us know if anybody's surprised by Matt's take on this. <laughs> what happened to fucking you know Clint Eastwood and? But that, I, I do like that. Like that's more my. Like I like, but but you're like ah, oh, but if you wore a dress, no, that it's would, just remember that would... when you were like in your show, you're like, what? What's your dream guy? And I'm like confident. And you're like, that's gay. <laughs> that is like I like a guy who doesn't give a fuck. <laughs> I don't remember that. But... That was in the basement. Yeah, you oh, don't yeah. listen when women talk. No, yeah, no. I could have said anything, and you would have just been like, that's gay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm, like you're my dream guy, yeah. Matt. You're, you, you, it's you. And you're like, yeah, yeah. That's still gay. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's r- way more gay. But uh, yeah, so women are crazy. They go for confident guys, or they go for yeah, yeah, confident. Yeah, but like it's not. No, no, it's not like I see a guy wearing a dress and I'm like, mm, no, not at all. But uh, yeah, you said um, you said you wouldn't cheat. You just no. you just don't wouldn't no because you you know the hurt that it causes. Oh no, I'm just like, well, yeah, like I just would just, never, yeah, but I'm, just I'm loyal, loyal. Yeah, yeah, I'm a, yeah, 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 I'm a, I, yeah, I, I'm a I, stage five client. Like I got, <laughs> I think we got that from the first answer. <laughs> I, I, I didn't get like cheated on at the start, but, well I have like after, but like I didn't, the very first, like my very first relationship, we kind of, I thought my ex was, she was hanging out a lot with one of my other friends and I was like, he loves you. Like, and uh, she was like, no, no, we, we're all, we're just friends. We're just friends. It's like my brother's best friend at the time. And, uh, she, you know, I was like, he loves you. He, he has said it to you before. She's like, no, we, I would never, we would never. And then mm. I was going to Chicago. So it is my fault. Like she didn't really do anything wrong, but like, uh, I went to Chicago for a couple of months and I was like, right, we'll, mm. we'll take a break for now. Mm. And then when I come back, but then as soon as yeah. we got the break, she started banging that guy that I was like, right. So I, do you I had consider already, that cheating? 
No, it, I've done it shit wasn't like that. It wasn't cheating, but like, yeah, but it was like it's like what it was like. I worst, told you, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. He yeah, was yeah. the one. It's like where it's like not technically cheating, yeah. but you like hurt me. Like yeah. I was going over to America to like so anybody that I was going to be with, I wasn't even with anyone over there. I, yeah. I was thinking, oh, I'm going to be this fucking stud over me. Like I just realized I, I had gotten with one girl and I didn't know how to do it again. So I wasn't even with anyone, and then. Uh, people started messaging me like all my friends like did you say that uh, that she could get with him and i was like what oh no i was like so she was like doing it in front of people too in front of people oh, at, at like my at my friends parties evil. like at my friends houses no. like so it, it wasn't evil it was like i i had hurt her by asking for the break and like she was just no that's she false. just said she want she wanted it she didn't want to go out and find someone she just wanted she knew he wanted to so that was the thing but obviously we needed to break up no. anyway it was fine no it was but at we, your friend's houses this is yeah, not it was, acceptable so so that that really hurt me and then from yeah. then i've always had a kind of a thing it felt like cheating at the time yeah, of you course. know so uh it was just a betrayal like cheating it's like having sex and kissing and all that like not sometimes that literally doesn't make a difference so where'd you, know, you hide literally, literally where'd it means you hide nothing. the body <laughs> no no at that time i I didn't you know I, I i was just very sad like i was just like yeah I, I was just sad i just left it off like he he came up to me after. have you ever like, done that kind of like borderline kind of shit where you was like slash you guys tires or anything no no it's uh, weird because like looking at you i just assumed that you've slashed the guy's <laughs> tires <laughs> no no i i don't like that stuff like I, I'll, I'll just... Did you ever showed up at a guy's house? Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. my my buddy and I were talking about the other day. <laughs> yeah, he's but like, I he's like, I don't want to bring girls over because she might like. She, then she knows where I live. Like I'm fucked if if I if I you know if I dump yeah, it or something. Yeah, like that's more my style. You what do you do? You just show up like with a gun? Like what do you? Oh, like in a, no 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 no. You not spy in a bad on way. him? No, you it's stalk? more Have like you ever a, a guy? like take me back way like that Whoa. kind of way. Not like, in you a, knock on his door and you're like. No, it's, it's raining, yeah. you're fucking yeah, drenched yeah, in the rain. Yeah, like, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> fucking smeared out. Okay, yeah. okay, yeah. yeah smeared no, all the I don't do the, shit. like, vindictive stuff like that. That, no, you're yeah. just you're just like emotional. That kind yeah, of yeah. That, that, gir that girl that was from the start. Yeah, so yeah. we so we split up, but like for like a year after, like she was always messaging me. We were our first. We were each other's first. So she was like messaging me, trying to get back the whole time. But I was like, no, I was I was over it. It just hurt me a bit too much. But even the guy, the guy, like we're friends now again. At one point, one day we were just out in a nightclub, and I just fucking. You're a nice he guy. just came up, and I just. Uh, we always were Beat friends before. Face he, was a, he, 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 he was he was a kid. Like, I'm like just, ready for he, 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 was, he, he, was a, he was a kid. So like one day he just uh, I just fucking he was out and we kind of looked at each other and then I just I just gave him a hug. And I was like, ah, oh, this is always okay. This is dude. Oh. You just killed my boner. I know. I, yeah, I, know. Yeah, I needed to kill it. You were getting too round. This is like I've known this growing up. Like the girl will cheat with one of the guy's friends, and then Classic. they, in the end, she'll realize they, it was a terrible thing to do, but and then she can't get back. Oh, sorry, yeah, no, they, they yeah. break up, and then, but then the guys will like become friends again, and the girl will be made into the villain. It's like fuck off. The friend is just as much of a villain. He was. You don't think that way though, because you're like, oh well, any guy would accept. Well, this sex. was like six months after. Like I, I did hold yeah. it against him for a minute, but I, then I, after I was like, but you, but I don't yeah. care about her is there anymore. A time so why period? am I? Or is it just you? No, can I just think it's bullshit to like hold one person accountable for two people's mistakes. No, I, like, and everyone always holds the girl accountable. No, I mean like, like, well, I mean, she, if, she used uh, to come over. Like we we did have sex during that time. Yeah, like good. she would come up, she would <laughs> come God. over and stuff. Like it wasn't. Like, but not often. It was just every yeah. now and again. But then I was like, no, I want to cut it off. Like, yeah. we, we did. Well, we did maybe okay, three okay, times. Okay, so I, yeah. I kind of for, I forgave her as well. Do you know? Yeah. At the same time, I've but, just known this multiple times where like the guys will become friends after, and then they're like this whore though. I'm like, she didn't but, trick anyone. Well, one one day, like a year, it was like a year later, and uh, do you know she knew my dad obviously. Like, um, she was over before all the she time. Your dad too. And <laughs> no, but. But I was, she was texting me one night. She's like, I'm coming back to your place. Uh, one time I was home, I guess, I think I was probably yeah, living in Toronto. Yeah, Hannah move. She's like, I'm coming over your place. And I'm like, no, no, don't. I was like, yeah. I, I'm just, I'm tired. I, I don't yeah. want to. And we hadn't been together. I, I just wanted to cut it off. Yeah. And I was like, no, no, don't. Um, and that was it. I just stopped messaging back then. And uh, I went home, I went to bed. And I woke up the next morning, she was in the bed beside me. For oh sure. shit! And, but my she messaged and then my she patched Matt's she, roof. She messaged my dad. 
she messaged my dad like <laughs> asking <laughs> asking could she come over Fuck off. and my dad was like yeah I'll get Darren sex for sure she, he's like, <laughs> he's like <laughs> yeah yeah come over and where's the part where she got your dad's oh. number she, I guess she messaged him on Facebook probably. Oh my god! And then, uh, then I woke up and uh, the next morning I was like, she was, she was upset, and so she was like, "I'm sorry, I'm really sorry," because I turned over and I was like, "What the fuck?" And um, did you fuck? No, no, what? I got out of it because I was like, this was in the morning, like, and yeah, I, I turned over. You let your dad down. Yeah. I, I got, a, I just got Does out of bed. You're like, probably so like, I'm yeah. so proud and of this, my boy. You like, like you're going, you're making a hand gesture, like you're. Nah, this, this he's probably jerking up. off in the yeah. next room. Yeah, like, it, it come was, on, Darren, <laughs> let's go, boy. <laughs> Dude, uh, yeah, you're a disappointment, off, Darren. You're well, a disappointment. No, but I, I was just so, like, it scared me. Like, I jumped, and then I jumped out of bed. I was like, what the fuck? And yeah. I, really, I did want, it to, I did want to hit her, it to hit home that it was finished as well. Yeah. So I was like, no. And she was like, I know, I know. She's like, is it okay? Like, I, I don't know if I, if I can get to town. I'll call a taxi or whatever. And I was like, nah, like... <laughs> he did this he'll drop you to town don't worry and I just I was like dad you fu-. like yeah. dude I, I was like thank you very much for thinking yeah. this or whatever but um, and he's nah, like she, well, don't, don't, don't an- get laid he, I was like don't answer like, quest and yeah. he was like don't I didn't answer. I didn't know what to do and uh, but I was like can, can you give her a lift to town and he was like yeah of course wow. and he just he just that went down move, though, and dude. he was like hey how are you I won't say her name obviously but he's like yeah. hey how are you? he was just so nice about it he's like how are you great to see you uh, uh, do you have a good night and all that she's just, you got a great now. fucking dad my dad's he, my never dad, my, dad my dad's cock blocked me he's but he's never never tried to get me laid ever yeah uh, no. I'm gonna oh, fucking. Yeah. I'm gonna call. Him no, my dad this. is different. Um, like the reason I am the way I am, like, is because of him. Like he the stuff he texts me. Is Should we get crazy. Hannah to clean some more? Like, have we had enough of her yet? Or what do you guys think? Um, oh, I, I forgot my list. Yeah, we have a list oh, yeah, for you, um, dude. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell this, tell this story, and mm. it's probably gonna suck. But fucking okay, because you reminded me of this. I had this friend when I was like 16. And we just smoked weed together. Like, we were basically just weed friends. We didn't even talk. And and we just smoked. That was it. Mm. He would come over to to my parents' house, and we'd sit in my basement. We'd smoke. And it would go to the point, even on, like, weeknights, school nights or whatever, he would smoke himself to the point. We were silent the whole time. We'd just turn on the fucking TV, smoke massive amounts of weed, and then he would just sleep. He would just go to sleep. He wouldn't ask to sleep over. He would just fucking go to in sleep. In your house? Like, yeah, it, yeah. On, in the basement couch. My, I would wake up in the morning and my mom would be like, is this kid fucking homeless? Like, what's, <laughs> well, who's this kid <laughs> that you have over? He never even talks. Yeah. What the fuck is this guy? Anyway, she she didn't like it. But, uh, like, I, I used to just... It you was know, your mom's house. Like, it was, yeah, yeah. Was yeah. House, yeah. So. And I used to fucking... He would go to sleep in the basement... I, I would just be like, all right, fuck it. Like, I'm going upstairs to my room. And one morning, I woke up, and the kid was beside me in my bed. <laughs> How did you know him? Was it from school or whatever? Is it? Yeah, 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 yeah. And he wo- I, I, I'm like, what the fuck are you doing? And then he's like, like he didn't even say anything. He's like, oh, uh, uh, and I was... Uh, you just tired of the basement. I, don't, I guess. And then, like, I was too scared to kick him out of my bed. <laughs> So, what, so what did you did you just go back to sleep or did you get out and you got up started doing push ups? I sucked his dick. No, but <laughs> <laughs> I was too scared not to. Yeah, <laughs> no, but I, scared yeah, not to. I didn't know what he would do. This guy seems like a lunatic. But no, I just fucking um, I don't know. I just like rolled over to the other side. It was pretty. It was a sizable enough bed that we weren't like our legs weren't touching. But see, but weird. see, if you do that but, the opposite way around, if you do it to a girl, that's extra fucked. Like that, Holy that's shit! Like, yeah, dude. Yeah. So obviously, so it's never happened to you. Then someone's been in your, like, been in the bed. No. Because after a party or anything, this never was, know somebody might. Well, okay. So this happened to my friend at, at a hostel. Mm. Um, there was this one fucking gross guy. She was on the top bunk, and he was just like fucked out of his mind and getting into bed with her. And she was like, she jumped out of bed. She was freaking out, and I was like, this is unacceptable. And I was just like screaming at him. No one could get yeah. him out of this bed. And then his girlfriend or whatever, yeah, she she was like fucking him or whatever, comes in, she like throws water on his face. And I was like, I'm getting this guy kicked out of the hostel. Like, I was so pissed. Yeah, no, you can't sleep in a room, the same room as a fucking 
reptile that would do that. Oh, know. just like, yeah, disgusting. And then and then the next day, he was just like, oh, well, I was just drunk. And it's like, no, fuck no, you. No, but like, the we're... girls are telling exactly. you to stop. Exactly. Like, if we're screaming and you won't, like, get out of People get into the wrong bit. Like, she go... couldn't even get out because she was, like, on the inside and he was, like, climbing on top of her. Oh, it's so gross. I've, I've gone back to my bed in a hostel at, and yeah. somebody's been in it. Like, but then I'm, do you know, I'll just sleep somewhere else. Like, then, like, but, yeah. but like, because you can make mistakes. You forgot you were in a different yeah. hostel yesterday. Yeah. That's where your bed was. And people do get fucked it, yeah. uh, fucked up. But like somebody one day, somebody was asleep in the wrong bed, I guess. Yeah. And someone just came to them and fucking this fella, he fucking woke up everybody. He woke up. He was like, hey, buddy, you're in my bed. And he was like, oh, shit, sorry. I'll, um, I'll, I'll move right now. And he was like, no, no, it's, it's fine. It's like, okay. Uh, and then he just he just he just woke up everyone to make sure yeah. everyone knew that there's someone in the wrong bed. Like we're, we're living we're nomads. Like living, yeah. you know. Um, oh no! If it's two guys, shut the fuck up. Yeah, just like, like to, But she was like, "Where you know, were you?" In Australia. Um, but she was just kind of like trapped <laughs> in the bed, so I was like screaming. But also the reason I went so hard was because he had been pissing everyone off all week. And mm-hmm. then so she goes, oh, like the owner of the hostel wants me to write a letter, but English was her second language. And I was like, step aside. And I wrote like the biggest sob story about how traumatized we were as women. <laughs> I was like, I'm going to get, and he got kicked out. So no, like, yeah. 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 That's, you got to yeah. use the, exactly. the exactly. I was yeah. like, this yeah. is all bullshit, but I'm going to get this guy kicked out. Yeah. As long as you don't go too far. Remember we, we were no, talking about me, but, no, but yeah, but hundred no. percent that, that was warranted. That, that because fellow was, was a reptile. Just an asshole, a, asshole anyway. So yeah. we're just like, fuck this guy. We're done with him so yeah. yeah yeah no you should never have to sleep in the same room as somebody you don't like like i i know that <laughs> firsthand i've done it for years yeah a lot of times like and i can't you can't go to sleep if you're if you don't feel safe in yeah. that room but most of the time in hostels oh but i moved amazing. away i moved yeah. away from my ex like my my most recent ex went to mexico and started sleeping in rooms with 12 people yeah and yeah. that was the first time in two years that i slept like a baby yeah because oh, yeah. I felt safe. So awesome. I felt like yeah. I like everybody in this room. All yeah. 12 of you fucking weirdos. Yeah. Uh, just, I know my, my fucking it is Brazilian kind grandpa of is like, going to slip um, my troth in my sleep. Very like tribal. When you're yeah. like all like surviving shit together and you're all bonded and you're just like sleeping in a dirty house. This yeah. is what I said to you. I'm like, th- some of the best times of my life I've been sleeping among like the cockroaches and the rats in a room full yeah. of 12 people. And I'm like, this is where I'm supposed to be. Like, yeah. you just feel so at home. So, yeah, just yeah. see like seeing bugs on the wall and like just hoping, <laughs> yeah, just totally. watching it as you go in to Australia, sleep. I there'd hope be like, that's not yeah, next to me. There'd be spiders like this big. I'd be like, fuck. Yeah. And, like, like, you have to deal with that. Please like, don't I love come that. It's tribal. Pillow. You come oh, home yeah. with a disease. You're like, this is my yeah. rite of passage. This oh, is, yeah. yeah. I would, in, in Australia, everything's like killing you. It was great. Yeah. Like, truly. I'm just like, oh. My my friend got bit by um like a black widow. It's called a red back there, but it was a uh, a male, so she so, she lived. Jesus <laughs> only, only the females have like deadly deadly amounts of venom. But that was a hilarious day. Like we had, I've never laughed harder in my life than yeah. when I thought the person next to me was about to die. Like because you're yeah. just like you're literally just surviving. You're like working the land and surviving, and you're like. Well, <laughs> this is what I'm, I'm supposed but, to be doing. But if we were in, if we were in a bunker, like all yeah. any oh, comedian that's killing. done the dungeon, we were in a bunker. The end of yeah. the world is happening. Like we we're literally yeah. going to die as soon as the tins we, of beans run out. We would laugh all oh, the way to the this end. Is, yeah, like I, every day we, I would get home from this farm work, and we were like being traumatized by these farmers. And then we'd be all upset, and then like within half an hour, we'd be just weeping because we'd be putting on the performance of our life, just making each other laugh. Because you're like, this is, is all I have. That's how you get through hard yeah, times. Yeah. You laughed about but it together. But I'm speaking what of the, bunkers, What were the farm? What are you talking it's about? It's farm work in Australia. To get your it's, second yeah, year. What were they doing? Were they whipping you? Like what? people have died out there. Are you on serious? The, I swear to God, that, that's how bad this farm work is. It's insane. No one really what are you knows. Farming? It's like a dirty secret. Um, fruits and vegetables for the most part. I was on a cattle farm, which is hilarious. I don't eat meat so the whole time I was there but once you get on there like I didn't eat meat and I was like these cows need to fucking die yeah, like, did you just you, hate them did you kill oh. any cows like um I mean probably from neg- negligence <laughs> 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 like I wasn't a good farmer <laughs> like a lot of cows oh, died man. while I was there and 
I yeah. was like, yeah, not my problem. Yeah, I, I'm a vegetarian too, but I feel like if I yeah. lived on a farm, then I wouldn't be. There, I would just be like, yes. fuck these cows. That was the fuck closest yes, I've cows. ever come to eating meat because one of them was like blind and they had to kill it anyways. And I was looking at the meat and it was so fucking different than what we get here. It was like there was not an ounce of fat on it and the girls were like, this is the best I've ever had. So I was like... That's gross. There should be fat in it, right? Isn't that like what you want? Can um, I just can I just get a little bit of recognition from our Irish fans how progressive I've become that I'm on a podcast <laughs> with two <laughs> vegetarians? <laughs> Do you eat fish? I eat fish. Then you're not a vegetarian. I didn't say. I said I don't oh. eat meat. Oh, true. Yeah, yeah I've always did. Ate fish. Yeah. Yeah, no, I, I, uh... But the fat thing, um, uh, for sausages, it was, it's, it, that means it's, like, better quality. Because the butcher is, like, making them himself. Because a fatty sausage is just, like, scraps of fucking waste. There's people walking by. Sausages in, uh, in Ireland are fucking killer. They're, like, they're, I can they're imagine, my, they're that's what I'm saying. The North American food, meat like is, Irish like, sausages. disgusting. Yeah, it's Wait, just did you garbage. eat it while you were there? I didn't end up eating it, but I was, I was like, uh, th- I was like, this is the only time I would feel, like, good about it, because I know I've seen the cow that it came from, and, like, you I know. You bitched out. You wimped out. You should just well, I was just like, No, well, fuck you. Meat is I, tasty as shit. Yeah. Like, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. But she I, she I didn't bitch out. She manned up. Yeah, I was like. No, she didn't. No, She bitched out. She should have fucking. No, nah, she should have ate thing. the steak. Yeah, the yeah. easy thing is just eating it. But I was just like, well, I, the e- the I easy, get it. If you're already a vegetarian, the easy thing is not eating. Yeah, exactly. It's, sta- oh, it's staying yeah, where, yeah. You, where you are. You opened up your mind. Right, I, but I didn't eat it. But oh, I you didn't eat it? No, I was oh, saying, dude. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm not fucking I, agreeing with you. Okay, okay, but I was, I was considering it. But then, because I, I was like, this is the only time like I would really agree with this. But then I was like, yeah. I'm, have you never eaten meat? No, I have, I have. But the main reason I don't eat it is because I just doesn't agree with me. Like, I just get so much diarrhea. Okay, <laughs> go back to Cleveland. <laughs> We're done with you. Okay, yeah. have you have you got, have you gotten through all of this? Did so you show the list? list? This was her. Uh, this is her set list for today. But I wanted to say, um, Happy Holocaust Memorial Day. I didn't even know it was. Yeah, I figured. That's in fucking August. Oh, is that today? No, it's no, today. It, it was trending on Twitter this morning. Yeah. Just, I was like, it I was, have to bring It was this just up. just above um, coward at the cottage. What? Do you, do you, did we already talk about this? Or no. I don't know if it was. It was uh, like really? Trudeau is, at, like he is a close contact right now, a uh, close contact for COVID. But the truckers are going to get there tomorrow. Truckers are going through Toronto today. So Trudeau did leave. Uh, somebody was he, telling somewhere. me that he said he's, he's at. He's at. Uh, he's, he's. He just said he's self isolating for five days, but he's obviously yeah. hiding away from the truckers. Yeah. Because mm-hmm. they, they probably like. Because so a lot of them probably are lunatics, like. But they're doing the right thing. Well. Most of them are doing the right thing. This is in the two years. This is the first time he's like self isolated. Yeah, but he like has to just, say, oh, I, I know he's just I like was a close out. contact. Yeah, exactly. We've already said that's not even a yeah. thing anymore. He's clutching yeah. the straws. He's literally leaving so he doesn't yeah. die. Like, because they yeah. probably truckers are For mad. Sure. Co- they could be mad cunts. They could just throw him into one of the trucks. Like, yeah. so mm. he needs to go into hiding. Uh, so he's oh, he's sure. in a secure place. But I don't think he'll be back out. Like, the truckers are not going to leave until. This is done, and then we're all gonna start. Ru- so. We're all gonna start running out of food, though. Is the only problem. Yeah, there's no tofu. <laughs> Hannah knows. Hannah knows how to farm, though. We'll yeah, be, we'll be I know how to kill a, do you know, a cattle. Do you know where to find a cow? Though? <laughs> where, where, how far do we have to go? Oh, that that you'll have. You have to bring me the cow so that I can raise. That's it what I was thinking. Yeah, she if I find the, the cow, I'll, yeah. I'll figure it out. Yeah. I'll figure it out. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so was, oh yeah. Holocaust Remembrance Day. Yeah, it's trending on Twitter anyway. I don't know if, yeah. if it is. Happy so, Holocaust yeah. Remembrance Day. So everyone go out fucking and I think, it, I think it's, um, a, it's ne- it says ne- what's the nine eleven one is never forget, is it? Or yeah. lest we forget. It's a, it was a different no, word. Lest it was we so, forget is World War Two. Is it? Whatever. <laughs> no, they, they're all just you know. Never forget. I, I, for, I forgot. Never again yeah. is the Holocaust. Never again. So okay. we can do nine eleven again. We just can't forget about it. <laughs> It's fine. You can do it as many times as you want, mm. but don't forget. Well, they used to. They used yeah. to like. So I can't remember who was talking about it, but they said like they started. Uh, they started doing COVID deaths in nine elevens. They were like, that's like nine a nine eleven every day. Yeah. About COVID deaths, it's like, oh shit! Now I think I just think about mass deaths in nine elevens. It's like, yeah. how much was World War Two? Like a couple of hundred, a couple of thousand nine elevens. 
was the Holocaust. But um, yeah, nine eleven was terrible, yeah. obviously. But we uh, there's people dying in Afghanistan like right now. They're getting like people in Afghanistan are selling. Oh yeah, COVID? I wanted to talk about that. No, not the fucking COVID. You fuck. They don't they have don't, any vaccines they, there. They don't we need have, to get them the vaccine. Yeah. They don't. They don't have time to think about COVID. They, there's people like selling their kidneys for. Um, selling their kidneys and kids for food because they're, they're running uh, out of food the Taliban have taken over obviously oh yeah and uh, nobody's getting fed everyone's fucked and there was uh, an English reporter it's I was just watching it yesterday kids. I know yeah but they don't think they're, they're not Irish thinking way, right. right it's a very Irish thing no it's not <laughs> yeah you guys do that eating, eating our kids yeah yeah modest proposal yeah the, it's Irish. Yeah, an educated man. <laughs> they didn't tell us that. They didn't tell us that. And if they did, I blocked it out. They didn't. My parents didn't eat me. May, or maybe I had extra brothers. And, who, yeah. who knows? But we, I wasn't in the family. 12. But in Afghanistan, they're, they're all selling their kidneys. And this English reporter on Sky News was just like going through a, a line of people on the street. And they were all like holding up their things with fucking with the scar. Damn. And I was like... How oh m- how much pieces of shit are like reporters? Yeah. They're like imagine if they're also holding their baby shoes. Like yeah, they're, they're, <laughs> no, but they're no. not, probably yeah. are holding like a, a fucking. They're like baby show us the scar, and then you get the, and then you get the packet of peanuts. It's yeah. like you fucking scumbags, just for your story, and you're pretending well, we're yeah. showing this, we're showing this. Just tell oh, us, dude. we believe you. It's it the same matter. with them. You need to fuck it. You yeah. need to fucking show people with their sca- like. It's the yeah, same with Bell. 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 Yeah, it's the same with the it, Bell. Let's talk thing. Yeah, that's yeah, exactly yeah, what it is. Bell. Yeah, let's yeah, talk. Yeah, it's yeah. all about us. Like, let's fucking talk. Uh, every time you fucking, every time you make a phone call on Bell, then we'll give five cents to them. I have the five cents here. <laughs> make the phone <laughs> yeah, call, yeah. and I'll give it to the poor skinny boy. I'll give it yeah. to him. I'll give it to him. Stop waiting. Stop making me no, wait. I Let me give it yeah. to him. Let me give it yeah. to him. He's starving. He's starving. <laughs> Make some phone calls on Bell, please, please do it. I really want to give him the money. Just give him the fucking money, you cunt. Yeah. If you have the money, help them. No, we Stop have to fucking put a hashtag it on, on our Instagram you story fucks. for them to give it. We're like two more hashtags and we help out the schizophrenics. So. Obviously, Darren, I think you need to talk to impo- somebody. Yeah, yeah I'm ta- I am. I'm talking. I'm talking to uh, I don't know, 17 people right now. Yeah, we need to get you some support. No, I don't need sport. This is all I need. I just need to rant into the microphone. I need coffee. I need shrooms. Everything I disagree is fine. with the reporting, though. I think that international reporters are a step above corporations. Like you're comparing them to Bell. I think they are just trying. Maybe. Are you I kidding? The, the are you kidding? The corporations are you own the media. Yeah. Do you seriously not? But, but you have no, no, no. I I agree with that. I'm saying of yeah. course they're scumbags, but I also think there are reporters out there that are genuine. No, just, not no. Don't hold think on. A hold on. Reporter. Hold on. Hold on. No, because I, I'm I've known a lot of people who got into journalism or went through journalism yeah. school. They don't give a. F- Fuck. You don't know them all. They don't give probably a is fuck. Good. There's good people but in every industry. Yeah, yeah, but that's like. And they get, yeah, and but obviously we're we're and they, into, we're generalizing yeah. everything we're talking about. Okay. <laughs> yeah. You're so right. take everything with yeah. a grain of salt. Yeah. Okay. But no. Are you, guys, are you guys taking notes? Take this notes. Dude, dude. The, dude, the people report? go to yeah. journalism school that that fucking they get hired by CBC. They they fucking do an intern. They're. They're sucking dick. They're doing anything to keep this fucking job. They they have they have absolutely no say. But there's in people whatever probably the fuck. sucking dick to keep their Walmart job as well. Like, of course, sure. like yeah, that's, it's the it's same every thing. Industry, it's yeah. every yeah, fucking industry. But yeah. it's very hard. It's very hard to make it. When in, you can in, suck a dick, that's not hard. But. It's very difficult to make it onto <laughs> CBC's roster of fucking journalists as yeah. it is. So once you fucking get there, if CBC says. Tell this story. You're gonna tell this story. You're not gonna tell it. Yeah. Read any fucking article anyway. And you know, and you know there's what's rogue, crazy there's too. There's rogue agents that fucking that do the right thing. Like there was some, like this there was it, independent yeah. reporters yeah. and shit. Sure, but yeah. even even sure. there, there is like good fucking news sources that let people yeah. do what they want. Like there was there's a famous journalist in um, in Ireland and it was Veronica Gearn. There's a deadly movie about it, and she she got killed. Yeah. after uh but there, she used to exactly. go up and like interview like the just the biggest like gang leaders in in dublin and stuff she was exposing everything and they were always trying to kill her and uh, and eventually eventually they did they beat the fuck out of her a couple of times so there there is people that want to do good in, yeah. in all industries and but this- but like this thing like going down to afghanistan pretending you're making a difference you're like 
show us your thing like not not yeah. treating them as humans like not treating them as equals it's just like yeah everything's bad let's tell the people and then we'll make it we'll make it fine yeah. we'll, we'll give you four tins yeah, of beans yeah there was that it's um, like, Tina Fey fuck movie you, on like, this was there? Yeah, where you saying I, there. it's not my no. original thought? No, I'm just going. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Pretty much, there's a whole movie on it where she's she's in the Middle East reporting, and it shows the reporters just like to get the story. They're just like slitting each other's throats, throwing each other under the bus. Like yeah, it's that's, like yeah. at one point one of them gets kidnapped, and she just like makes a story out of it. Like it's a comedy, but it's like yeah. just showing how like ruthless they are. Yeah. So yeah, you're right. You're right. So I apologize for plagiarizing Tina Fey, everybody, but you should know that I've never seen anything by Tina Fey, so <laughs> I didn't plagiarize it. <laughs> Who's Tina Fey? I, I'm funny. sure. No, I'm sure she. I'm sure she's great. Is I, that I a hear, woman I of hear some that sort? she's good. Yeah, I hear that she's good. <laughs> is that one of these? Is that one of these female said, comedians I, that I, I've heard I, of? I, I really like female comedians. I, I think like uh, tomorrow, uh, if you haven't got tickets. We got Sandra Badalini. She's one of the best in the city. And uh, male or female. You have three and, women um, on your show tomorrow. Yes. Yeah, so Holy you, there's, shit. There's uh, Sandra, yourself, and and Aaron. Uh, and Aaron. So come. So, so it's, a, it's a safe space tomorrow night. It's three women that don't talk about safe yeah. shit. But, yeah. But it's... Uh, <laughs> three, like, <laughs> worst women yeah, we, to have on. I, I, we, I actually tried to get Sarah Donaldson again. She's out of the, she was out of the city. I'll have her uh, soon. She, do you know Sarah no. Donaldson? Oh, holy shit. Yeah. She's like... She's fucking ridiculously okay. good. She's oh. uh, do you, you you know Sarah? Do you? I have a bit of a story there, but yeah, yeah, she's, yeah. Uh, she's, don't she's say great. Anything, she, no, she's great. Yeah. No, she's great. No, she's great. She she was running a show at like Young she Young in fantastic. Eglinton. It she's was a one food. It was a she's food a truck killer. show. It was outdoors, oh, wow. and she put on. So Young in Eglinton, for those who don't know, but that's an area in Toronto, of very like rich, fucking well-to-do, mm. fucking safe fucking hipster kind of types whatever and uh it was like a food truck thing it was anyways all bougie and whatever and we we she put on it was me and her and ben bankus and uh dan guyrie nice and basically like the it was pretty it was pretty (laughs) close to a riot like it was it did not go well like there was there was booing there was legit oh yeah yeah, there was legit yeah yeah, she was running that show and she put me on, and then I came and I saw the crowd. I'm like, oh, I don't think she really like screened me at all. Like, I don't think she really like I mean, none knew of those what guys she was. Are, no, and are, yeah. yeah, and then it kind of started off on like it hit a little snag there, and the audience was d- just done. And then by the time I got on, I started getting fucking booze, and uh, wow. it was pretty epic. It yeah. was pretty hardcore, and Sarah was like, "Yo, man, that was great." <laughs> Uh, yeah. Sarah's made yeah. me laugh so yeah. much, man. There was She's one so day cool. in the corner, there was a couple of young kids, like, and she was telling them how she would fucking ruin their life if they, you know, to ha- if she would be, if they would bang her, like, she would fucking. She's like, I would give you something that you have never fucking understood. It was just like, the, I was in tears in the back, and she was just straight off her head. She's very, very good. So hopefully, she'll be on the dungeon soon. She was away this weekend, but um, Jam Easy's talking there. He's uh, giving, he's loving the truckers, and he also wished you a happy Remembrance Day. <laughs> my mother joined too, so I, oh, I gotta, God. yeah. So we gotta clean, my, my, clean up. Yeah. My clean grandparents. Up. Oh, I, you want me to clean up again? <laughs> no, just just not no vulgar mouth. My she grandparents would be here, but uh, they couldn't because you know, <laughs> <laughs> you know. the Holocaust. Uh, uh, yeah. uh, uh, dude, uh, before before we even wrap up, though, I I'll you have... don't t- tell you. I'm just thinking. You, are, are we at wrap up time? Are we? Yeah. Is it, are we got an hour? Almost. Go. Cool, we can keep going. But uh, you're yeah. You you have a Holocaust joke actually that that you haven't you haven't said in a while. I have several. But yeah. They, but, they, but yeah, just just bring them back. Bring them back. <laughs> yeah. For the remembrance. Tis the yeah. season. Yeah. Tis the season for Holocaust jokes. Yeah, like yeah. every comedian has like their Christmas jokes and like yeah. their New Year's jokes. Now you have your like. Do, 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 do you do you want to explain to me the the M M&M and M thing? Because I, I I didn't look it up. Apparently, it's a big thing right now. I, okay, I didn't look uh, it up. Hannah's gonna have to explain. I have yeah. so many. I oh man, we're we're gonna have to have you back. But I had so many <laughs> questions about bisexuality <laughs> that I wanted to ask you. There are what, so what, many what time, bisexual what time questions we, here. We're, we're good for we're good till yeah please. we're good for another twenty five. Okay, right? well, first and foremost, this yeah. is the most important thing. So, do you eat ass? Okay. If Bye. so, if so, 
Would you rather a man's ass or a oh, woman's I'll ass? I'll say a woman's, yeah, for oh, sure. Oh, okay. For sure. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm, oh, that's all my questions. <laughs> <laughs> the podcast now. Uh, <laughs> Thank you guys. That's, that's, <laughs> that's all we needed. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Holy fuck. Cool. Yeah. But this has yeah. got like bringing a woman on has gotten my mother to watch my podcast live. So wow. it's it's yeah. a good thing. But she good still thing. hates you. Oh, she's going to hate me even more yeah. now. But no, no, I think I think she'll enjoy it. She's like Darren's not this. Somebody sell, like, dude, somebody I don't know messaged me like and he's clearly Irish because he's incoherent. <laughs> and, he, <laughs> and he messaged me like a whole slew of fucking things and one thing he kept calling me a reptile. But he's like, Darren's mom hates you. Oh Shane. Darren's yeah. mom, she hates you. And I'm like, why? Like I'm not yeah. that bad. I don't know. But yeah, anyway, so hi Darren's mom. Um Aww. I don't know. I I, I, I like you, Celia. The, I like uh, your the, son. The, the owner of Nia Natural Beauty. Yeah. E. Great skincare. Uh, go on to that website. Valentine's Day is coming up, so you gotta get your Nia. Okay. E. That's right. Let, let's plug right. in some sponsors. Nia. E. Nia. E. It's fucking unbelievable. Hannah, we're gonna actually. Yeah. Hannah's <laughs> OnlyFans. Um, <laughs> Ma, ma'am, I will. Uh, if you want to send over. Uh, some shit in the so next the next time money. we'll get we'll get some to oh, Hannah. Oh yeah, thank you. And uh, she'll plug it on yeah. here, I guess, next time. She, yeah, yeah, come on, you couldn't but, have like so she'll, she'll done a little something for the podcast or whatever. I'm kidding, I'm fucking. So look look at how terrible Hannah's skin is right now. <laughs> after, after she after she uses my mother's <laughs> cream, right it's gonna after, be a transformation. Yeah. You'll see it. So Nia yeah. Natural Beauty mm-hmm. dot IE uh, all homemade shit made in uh, Kilrush County Clare she's a Clare, pro Clare woman uh, yeah if you're in Ireland get that she'll deliver to Toronto too for sure or anywhere else in the world so I'm sure we have uh, fans in Afghanistan or whatever as well after all the good shit I'm saying about them yeah. also you want to give us a little thing about black yeah we, for all our fans in Afghanistan we have a discount for kidneys we're selling kidneys out of my place here no uh, we have um, we only have three but we, we're oh is that what I'm drinking Kidney juice? <laughs> no, the coffee. Yeah, you're drinking black ink coffee. You're not going to sleep tonight. This is good shit. No, but I did piss in it, so it's got a little kidney in there. But piss comes from the kidneys, right? Okay, yeah, sick. I'm good. Uh, okay, black ink coffee. That is uh, that, that is our proud sponsor over here. Black ink coffee. You can see it right here. We're going to post the link. You can click on that link, and we're affiliates with them. So, so we don't get a joke. We just You're just going to say black ink and think they're going to do it? Make it funny, you fuck. Yeah, that's what they're paying for. Fuck you. Wow. He hasn't had his this black ink his yet. Mom hates you. <laughs> Once he has his black ink, he, he's a nicer person. You don't want to see him before the coffee. That's right. Um, I don't know, man. No, if you if you're coffee watching joke. if you're watching like bullshit stuff that's not too gingers. Oh, like, drink it makes black ink coffee. Asleep. It'll help you to kill Trudeau and join the truck convoy. There we go. All right. Yeah, coffee. Uh, murder, yeah, murder you, the prime minister. If you're yeah. dri- if you're driving yeah. a truck for fucking ten hours a day, That's you right. need to stay awake. That's right. Black ink yeah. coffee. I'll do it for you. I, d- I was you. fuck this fucker. I'm just here to look pretty, guys. Yeah, yeah. What the fuck am I here for? Definitely not that. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh. Maybe, <laughs> maybe after maybe after the creams. Maybe you're after right. my mother's creams. Yeah. yeah, exactly. So M and M's. There's yeah. some bullshit yeah. going on with Eminem. Yeah. I don't even know. Dude, if we're gonna yet. get. I actively didn't. We're look gonna it. fucking get the story up here. Are you guys oh, wow. ready for yeah, this yeah, shit? Yeah, you yeah, keep yeah, talking. Yeah. I'm getting the fucking story. You if you go on to Matt's Facebook, that's it's not, me. It's not gonna you pop get, up on Instagram, but you'll see it later. Whatever, go back. Dude, if you go on my Facebook, you will see the story or the headline or whatever. Did you put it up? There will be a visual aid. I'm about to. You're gonna Jack, see this. Jack Easy said, "Trucker's got some wild boys in that bunch." He said, "The cause is good, but shit can go." Yeah, yeah. This is and this Jam Easy is, is a trucker, so uh, yeah. That's right. That's right. As uh, Jana said, it's about big dick energy. Nice. Yeah. That's that's. Uh. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. She, yes. And, that's a throwback, but that's what, what that, it's about. That, that you, was a boy back, you, you had the wrong answer for men. The what makes men ah, okay, okay, great. Yeah, yeah. Big dick energy. Oh, yeah. I said confidence. confidence you wouldn't know. Big you've big never. Energy. I know. Never, but she's going yeah. out with someone that. So may not have a big dick, but has big dick energy. That's why Jana said big dick energy. I don't know what size your dick is, but I, I don't know. Shout out to my boo. 
my but, uh, so she's like it's not about the size of the dick it's about the big dick energy so that's uh, it makes that's sense that's what his girlfriend said Jana said oh, it's all about big dick energy she, yeah. said, she said that a while ago she's like you guys know what I mean it's big yeah. dick energy energy yeah it's a <laughs> yeah, stipulation cause yeah. you know yeah <laughs> he's got the energy but so we're getting uh, is this story coming up now it's coming yeah. up, baby. If you guys yeah. can fucking uh, Hannah, why don't you tell us? So the they the want us to M&Ms, subscribe to this shit? they have all their like stupid little personalities for the M and M's, mm. and then the the green and the brown are girls, and the green's always been the sexy one because remember the green ones? They even did an ad like the green ones make you horny or whatever. This oh, was a shit, myth okay. from like the '80s or something, and then the M M&M, and M like leaned into it, so they made the the green one a total slut and like everyone loved it but now they're like oh that's not progressive we have to make her more comfortable so is she's what they like said. a fucking librarian so, or whatever well they swapped out her heels and now she has running shoes mm-hmm. and um i think she took off her false lashes as well but the brown one is still a whore she still has the lashes and the uh the heels yeah but every all the conservatives are mad because they're like, oh, they're. Did they you know. change the brown one to being a whore, or there just was two whores? I think there was two whores before. The green and the brown were both. And are they lesbians? Can you look that up? <laughs> yeah. They might be like this is. <laughs> is, this act- is this actually working? I don't. But then they're, they're just not. making it more like if they are lesbians, usually there is one like there's. Like, it's only in the movies that they're, that it's two lesbians that are... So this that are, is what I'm saying. Yeah. So, it's not, so it's, all the conservatives were mad because they're like, oh, they made one more mannish. And I'm like, well, that's actually more conservative yeah, just to make, make it, one of the lesbians look more like a man. Yeah. So I mean, they changed her shoes. That was yeah, like the and her, her lashes. Yeah. Look, she has no lashes anymore. She's not doing her eyebrows anymore. But this one's still a whore. And one of the things that I remember reading, I don't know if you just mentioned this, they wanted to make the green one and the brown one... Lesbians. Was it lesbians or more friendly? I just heard that they were going to become more oh. friendly as a move to show solidarity. But, but is there... Is, <laughs> that was literally it. It was to show no, solidarity. They're, they're friends. The yeah. women have teamed up together yeah. because... You know, solidarity. That's, but is there yeah. is there a, a TV show about this or something? <laughs> no, or no, no, no. This is just so their it doesn't, ads. It doesn't it's matter insane. at all. It yeah. doesn't matter at all. But I think so. Okay, so, I just, just assumed they were in a relationship. Working. But like, yeah. So they changed their shoes, and people are going nuts about it. See, that, yeah. that's, that's the now. Here's but, here's one thing that I've never understood, and fucking <laughs> call me call me crazy, but like, you know. The brown M&M mm-hmm. is also the black character. Is that right? Look, I... How I did we land on well, that? I don't like, know. Who, Look at- did we just Did we just roll the dice and say, oh, yeah, random random selection. We're going to make the brown M&M the black character. Well, when, when you're eating M&Ms, you're kind of just rolling the dice every time. Like, it is... It's pretty random. Like, it's it's just colors. Because one mean, of them's green. We don't have green people. If you look at people. their shoes, I would assume the yellow one is the black character because he's in, like, Timberlands. So. That's, that <laughs> is racist. I think, I think that was actually racist. We, we might have to cut that out. And it, is he in the orange one is a Jew. That's Why? actually what because he's anxious all the time. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't make it up, dude. On Holocaust Remembrance Day, you piece of shit. I didn't make that up. Who's the red That's one? That's what then? people are saying. The uh, red one looks pretty cool. He's the white guy, obviously. <laughs> Look at him. They did make him less cool. Look, he is he is more cool than the first one, just slightly, but he is a little bit more. The yellow one looks uh, looks pretty annoying. He's like he's the biggest cunt in the room. The but yellow one's the dumb one. He's, yeah, yeah, he, has he a looks dumb. dumb because yeah. if because anyone that's so big and you, strong, you needs really, to be dumb. you no, really, no, I'm, I'm, you really fucked up. Uh, I was just going <laughs> off the shoes. I was just going the off the shoes. The green one's the slut. No, she right. not anymore. That's no. the thing. But literally, she was before. Though. She still looks. Like a slut, but, but I feel less. Look at look at now. her. Look at her. Right, but if you know because if, I thought if you know women, that you know that she, even though she's in the shoes now, she's still she's probably a slut oh, yeah, inside. Yeah, inside. I thought we're normalizing slut. Yeah, culture. they were. Yeah, but exactly, I, they but just not really. they, Eminem made Eminem's made this whole thing. They they knew there'd be controversy and everyone's going to be eating yeah. Eminem's. It's a good it's a good strategy, whatever. But um, yeah, I'd still fuck the green one after. Even with even in normal shoes, who gives yeah. a bollocks? 
M and M's are pretty small, but but if they if they were bigger, I guess or whatever. Yeah, but uh, <laughs> yeah. I don't know what I'm saying. Hi, ma'am. <laughs> I would fuck and who's the blue one. Still give it to uh, the green M M&M. and M. And who? <laughs> Have it. Yeah, but, but probably more in the first picture. There's no already. new one. They just they just changed it. But who's the who's the blue guy? He oh, looks the like blue. the leader. In fairness, I, I think. No, the red one's the leader. Oh the yeah. The red one's always like he has like this you know snarky little comments and stuff. Yeah, the I blue, don't know the blue who, one's I don't know the blue I don't know who decided that this actually like. Like why yeah. it, you know it, yeah just so that it matters yeah just yeah, so like we're thinking. fighting like inequality with our M and M ad like insane that they give themselves that because it, it does oh fuck I I did watch something talking about this too but like just the whole idea that any fucking any brand or any logo mm-hmm. actually anybody's Disgusting. like looking yeah. like anybody's looking at Mister Clean and like having any yeah. kind of like social commentary yeah. on what the, the, the what the guy's mind. earring means like yeah. dude oh why is he bald like yeah. what does that mean about yeah. bald men but bald that's men what, are that's what boardrooms are like yeah. that's what yeah. boardrooms are like right now yeah it's, it's people in there doing like so have you watched any ads like i don't watch too yeah. many but if i'm ever watching football or something the ads come on it's like who the fuck taught of this like but i'm yeah. literally it's still in my head because yeah. it's so stupid so people are literally like if we make it so dumb They'll remember it, and automatically they'll remember that I should buy this kind of toothpaste. And it's just like somebody brushing their teeth, and like there's a bear behind them or something. Like no, it doesn't even Mr. make sense. Mr. Clean is gay though, I don't for know. sure, because like, it's gay for guys to clean. What straight guys do is <laughs> hire Hannah to do it. Yeah, and we're um, straight as fuck. Yes. On two juniors, no, one yes. white. We're the straightest. Yeah, we um, uh, we never big dick energy. We don't right like here. cleaning. Big dick energy. That's right. Big, big, dick, big dick, energy. dick energy. Big fucking dick. We got energy. it. So, uh, yeah, good job, Eminem, on your fucking... Um, yeah, well done. Good job. Um, good job. We applaud you. Yeah. Huge. Yeah. Like, it's nice, so nice, nice to see brands that are literally, um, I assume, <laughs> raping the rainforest and just, like, you know, have <laughs> child labor to, you know, really but you clean up their, their logo. And you can't, nice. you can't do this without the help of millions and millions of dumb fucking idiots that are on Twitter all day. So well done for using them to your advantage. Uh, You just drop something out there. They'll run with it. You don't need to do much. You, they'll yeah. they'll make a trend and they're like if good we job. change the green M M&M and M shoes, they'll forget that yeah. we're literally killing kids. They'll in the, forget. In the yeah. Amazon they'll forget right about now. the they'll forget about the Holocaust. <laughs> yeah. it's, it's just guys, guys, guys. Yeah. Holocaust Remembrance Day is coming up quick. What can we yeah. do to take yeah. over that story? We're gonna need a, a, to add M M&M and M to the Super Bowl <laughs> halftime show yeah. because uh, people are asking <laughs> yeah. questions. About I know where we already the chocolate have, comes yeah. from. Where's so, the prime minister? Yeah. Uh, did you guys know that yeah. uh, the new M M&M and M is for lesbians? Yeah, like, we, already, we already had Kendrick Lamar and Snoop Dogg. We thought that was enough to do a COVID, yeah. but then this trucker thing happened, and we we're like, we gotta, gotta add Eminem. Eminem. We gotta pull out Eminem. Like, if if they find out any more, yeah. they'll add fucking Jay Z and Beyonce, and they'll be able to release yeah. Harvey Weinstein. They'll be able to bring back Epstein Island. They'll be like, look, we never even <laughs> killed open. Jeff. We never killed Jeff. He's here. Yeah. Uh, he's on a reality show on the island. Yeah. Fuck you. You've got you've got Beyonce. And we're all like we're all sitting on our couches like in a chocolate coma, <laughs> like just a chocolatey coma. Yeah. Just chocolate everybody, just M and M's everywhere. M and M's absolutely everywhere. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Like you did this. M and M's, Mars. Yeah, it's funny that you would say the rainforest thing because Mars oh, yeah. is doing this whole thing now where they're not Mars any. They were doing this for a while. This branding. If they're not Mars anymore. They're Earth. Oh, it's called God. Earth. The Mars company is now Earth because they're standing with the Earth. And you're it's like, bullshit. no. Like, how did we get all this yeah. chocolate? Or like, where? There's, there's so <laughs> like. <laughs> They're like, there's going to be no more emissions yeah, in our, in our exactly. chocolate anymore. Exactly. It's like, wait, there's been emissions in our chocolate, <laughs> but yeah, there's yeah. like the shit that's gone in to making all these people <laughs> fat. We're yeah. taking the gasoline out of it, chocolate. But, like, <laughs> right. I was very confused. I was like, wait, what do you mean you're taking the carbon out of like candy but bar? They use that as, a, the as, a, are you talking about? as a strategy. It's yeah. like, they tell us about it. Yeah, we've actually been poisoning you the last yeah. 10 years, but we're, we're stopping now. Anymore. And we're the first ones exactly. to stop. Exactly. We're the first exactly. ones to stop doing this yeah. shit. It's like, yeah, we've been pouring oil into the seas this whole time, yeah. but we're we're the first company yeah. to reduce our oil by ten percent. Yeah, for for not doing it anymore. And they're yeah. like, we're amazing. Hey, they get a Nobel Peace yeah, Prize like, or whatever. It's like, yeah, we did it. We did it. 
There's, Thanks, guys. With chocolate, there's like so few companies that actually don't use like child labor or um, are like cutting down the Amazon. But Purdy's Oops. is a Canadian company and they, they're the best. So if you want to eat chocolate, you should go to Purdy's because they pass every single um, level of. Uh, what do you call that? Ethical chocolate. What'd you say? Je- yeah, I just, I'm just squawking. Don't Je- worry. <laughs> if you guys all shaved your heads bald, this podcast would be way better. <laughs> I had it too. I mean, we can't ask you to do that. Just oh, for... my hair is my superpower. I'm like uh, Samson. We got, oh my gosh, dude is on point. Even better if... The uh, Eminem or the rapper. Uh, we actually, we mixed <laughs> both of those things together and we didn't even mean to. So thanks. Uh, Rick. Uh, I totally uh, thought you were talking about the rapper. Jeff's body was never discovered. Never thought he could be on the island. <laughs> <laughs> Chocolate's not safe anymore. Yeah, Jeff is on an island, and yeah. um, I'm pretty sure. Well, I, I don't know yeah. any of this. This is speculation That's and made up. Right now. Trudeau's like, gone yeah, to that yeah. island, and him, him, yeah, him, him and true. fucking Jizz Lane are on the same <laughs> flight. All three of them are yeah. just like, and they're just there's no seats on the plane. Yeah, it's just no, no, no. full of ch- children, oh, yeah, just yeah, full yeah. of children. They just keep swapping crowd. all the way. Yeah. Mm. Where, where where is uh, little Saint little Saint James? Where where exactly is it? In the Caribbean or something? I assume. Uh, I, I I wouldn't know. <laughs> 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 you trying to fucking catch me or something? <laughs> Not today. <laughs> Like, oh, yeah, I just have it saved. Wait a minute. Yeah. So, but uh, a lot of people were there. There's a lot of people we could ask. Like, uh, Bill was there. The two Bills. Bill Gates, Bill Clinton, yep. Hillary. They were there all the time. But they were just there to make sure everything was okay. I guess they, they would never have. <laughs> no, they would never. They would never. No, it was never. just... Yeah. I was there to sign a it few was a documents. Quality, Literally, quality every control other check. person that went to that island raped a kid, but they would never. They were making they sure that never. there was no emissions in yeah, the, in the yeah, little boy's people. asses. They're I was just people. in there to find out how carbon, to get away carbon from free. there. Yeah. Carbon-free. Carbon-free... Uh, molestation yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they gave themselves a Nobel Peace Prize just make sure yeah. like guys when you're done with the condoms don't throw them into the sea please <laughs> yeah they didn't use condoms I don't think they used condoms <laughs> sure, no. uh, if girls, anything they used M&M wrappers the when, when, they the just wrapped an yeah, M&M wrapper around their clothes when you're, when you're done with the children make sure to take their clothes yeah. off before you discard them in the sea because their clothes and shoes might hurt the fish so yeah uh, we, we can't end there, can we? <laughs> no, okay, we gotta, you, you gotta, you to, we gotta bring the energy up, bring the yeah. audience back to liking us again, and uh, then we can close it out. So what? What we've got? We've got five minutes. Okay, so uh, equality, equality. We're all for just equality. Just in case someone just like skips to the end of the podcast, we'll just like do a, a false. False flag of like yeah, we never even, <laughs> we, we, yeah, we never even like we kind of started talking about equality. But yeah, equality is so important. Um. No, it's not. It's it's not. It's not even a thing. There is no equality. Like I'm not equal to Matt. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm not equal mm-hmm. to no. Hannah. Like none of us are equal yeah, in no, any no. way whatsoever. Some of us are born in Afghanistan and yeah. get have like people shooting at you all the time. Some of us are born in uh, retarded. Yeah, some of us are born retarded. Some of us are born. born <laughs> some of us are born black. Some of us are born white. Some of us are born whatever. And men, women. It yeah. doesn't matter. Everyone like everyone should get the yeah. the equal chance to do whatever they. Mm-hmm want to do Absolutely. but um you know everyone should be allowed to fucking work get the same money for the same work and all that shit but like we're not equal like no. i i am stronger than you yeah. like that's that's and a you fact always will be always always even if i that. even if i get aids yeah if i like will, lose oh, if, yeah. I, if i lose my legs if i was in a wheelchair i'd still i'd still you be stronger still be to, so it's yeah. like that that just doesn't change no. i will never um yeah. i will never have a baby like that's no. that's for sure like i'm not yeah able to do like that. when you're talking about what each gender is good at you're yeah. like you're obviously strong and then i'm good at having a baby so that's really cool <laughs> to bring up that's no, my thing that i'm good at <laughs> i'm not, i'm not good at walking in high heels <laughs> You guys, yeah, are, you guys exactly. are really good at that. Yeah. I'm, I'm, I've never tried, but I don't think I'd be good at putting on makeup. At, you suck at ironing shirts, dude. I'm you really bad at ironing. You have weak ironing. You're so bad. Yeah. 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 Like, yeah. Han, on the other hand. I'm really good at ironing. I'm sure you yeah. are. Yeah, I'm yeah. sure you are. See that? So Low iron, equality. but good at ironing. This is equality. Yes. Because of my periods. Vegetarian. Periods. Oh, <laughs> we don't have periods, so we don't yeah, know so what it feels really like. High, yeah. um, so we, we don't have periods, so we don't know that pain, but like we yeah. have to deal with women when they're on their periods. So you guys don't have that, yeah, which is, I, I think it's probably worse. Yeah. But 
I mean, because I go through pain, like I, I'm a fighter, so I, I like getting punched in the face. Yeah. So I think. So does she. So does she. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I, I prefer, that where we are, equal. I prefer the pain. Like I, I feel good when I'm when I'm in pain and when I'm getting hit, like because it makes me feel yeah. like I'm not made out of glass. So I'm like yeah. the pain is actually nice, like the end of a workout, oh, yeah, that yeah. last few push-ups that I don't think I can do. Pain is good, but uh, obviously I don't know what period pain is. I'm talking shit, but like mm. uh, listening to women when they're on the period is it can be pretty taxing. Okay. Yeah, mm-hmm. I know. <laughs> yeah. Um, was that yeah, the high sure energy? Was that, that the high energy I'm, finish? I'm not sure if I should have said that. <laughs> <laughs> Do you, do, you, do, you, do you mind anything to I'm add? just surprised that you listen to women while they're on their periods. Uh, yeah, well, my ex was on her period the whole time. <laughs> right. Yeah, I think Entirely. it was some kind of medical condition. I mean, never I was going to ask you more about that, but we should. I do know you, someone who hasn't periods? had their period in like two years. Is that like your dream girl? That mm-hmm. hasn't had it? Yeah. Jesus, no. You know her too. I, I don't... <laughs> She I talks about it, so... I don't know how to... Um, well, you only know two girls, so who is Yeah, I, I know I, I, I know who you're probably talking about, but I don't know how to answer that question. I'm very uncomfortable right No, now. I think it's... Uh, I mean, from what you said, it seems like your dream girl, just never having someone bitching about that. But, I'm, but see, that's probably... Period sex can be good sometimes. Oh, and also, <laughs> just, like, don't get me it's wrong... It's a nice change of pace, you know? Don't get me wrong, though. Same women one. can be annoying when they're not... Also, it draws so less... Well, that's fair. It draws yeah. less attention of my, my cum being red, so... <laughs> It's, you know, the blood, uh, Yeah, you're yeah. like, this is your fault. Yeah, yeah. exactly. <laughs> All right, let's just see if, if we've gotten yeah. the viewers down to zero. Um, <laughs> that was the goal, right? We're, we're pretty yeah. close. It doesn't, doesn't actually show me how many... Uh, oh, no. How Darren went to science. No, I don't like science. I, uh, Justin Trudeau says I don't believe in it. Damn, uh, but baby. I realize you can delete these comments they, the comments will be gone after anyway yeah, so you can say ends. whatever yeah. you want on the live feed because Amazing. they don't the comments don't get through to the end it's just that we don't get to it then um, we can't someone just joined my dad just joined but this is <laughs> this is the very this here. is the very end but uh, yeah. welcome dad we're just fucking finishing up though so yeah. you gotta watch go this back again. to the beginning because we talked yeah, about you we did, uh, we did we did we talked, we talked about, about you you're a great dad and Darren's a disappointment yeah yeah. yeah, but fuck it. Dude, man, uh, like, what's your dad's name? Ian. Ian, good on you, man. Uh, my dad my dad never, ever, ever tried to get me lame. Uh, yeah. And I still, I hold it against him to this day. Uh, so, yeah, like, good on you. Uh, yeah. My dad's cock blocked me my dad, numerous times. My dad you fucking is working around the clock. <laughs> yeah. he, he works around the clock trying to get me lame, to yeah. be honest. Yeah, so he's a fucking, like, yeah, I imagine. pretty heroic yeah. man. And I love him. And, what did uh, I say? Uh, he, I think he just joined. No, someone said something. Uh, I sent a request to be in your live video. Who is that? Start again. <laughs> he said start again. <laughs> start the podcast again. Yeah, you should have him as a guest. We've do, well, yeah, we have. We had an idea for that actually, yeah. but we'll we'll uh, yeah. Will we sign off. We should. Yeah. What time are we on? Yeah, we got we got. Go. Thank you very much, everybody, for coming. Yeah. Uh, Thank you to Hannah for joining us and cleaning sure, up the kitchen. That was uh, fantastic. It's nice to um, come to Darren's show tomorrow. Yeah, come to Please. come to the dungeon tomorrow night. It's uh, so it's fun. at seven thirty. I'll send you the address. Send me a message if you need yeah. tickets. Let your friends know if anyone else would like to go because uh, tomorrow's gonna be a sick show. Che Durena is headlining. Yeah, he's fucking a killer. Um, Sandra Badalini and then Amazing. like we got some of the usual uh, yeah. the usuals like Natish yeah. Hannah's gonna be there yeah. fucking uh, Natish Kai Lucy there. there's um, yeah I, I'm not gonna go through the whole thing but it's on my Instagram come tomorrow it's gonna be a really good show Sunday is gonna be killer again they, they're not getting worse they're like everyone wants to do the show it's so, so much fun. they're getting better and better the whole time yeah. and we're getting better at fucking dealing with it and all that and uh, yeah Black Ink Coffee neonattributes.ie um Hannah Veldoon OnlyFans. Yeah, Hannah Dot I wish I had one on now. Instagram. I'm sure I get so much traffic. Yeah, uh, we, we'll this. we'll pro- we'll post we'll <laughs> right. a bunch audience? of incel yeah. maniacs. Yeah, we'll, this we'll is the most Hannah's views we've ever Instagram. had. But unfortunately, none of them were women. We have not we've not increased. There our... was my mother was here. <laughs> oh, so, and and yeah. Jana, Jana as well. Oh, nice. Okay, good. We're, yeah. we're happy that I said it right. That was great. Well, yeah. Oh, she she might not want so to say. Yeah, she entire... might not be be uh, associated. associated with this. But <laughs> sorry, I, I was just joking. It's a different girl. Anyway, <laughs> guys, thank you very much. We this love you. Two yeah. gingers, one mic. See you soon. Stay tuned.